Well, I'm the head of the executive branch, and the attorney general reports to me, so I've got to be careful about my statements to make sure that we're not uh, impairing any investigation that's taking place right now. Uh, but obviously, this is a tragedy. Uh, I can only imagine what these parents are going through. And when I think about uh, this boy, uh, I think about my own kids. And you know, I think every parent in America uh, should be able to understand uh, why it is absolutely imperative that we investigate every aspect of this and that everybody pulls together, federal, state, and local, uh, to figure out exactly how this tragedy happened. Uh, so uh, I'm glad that uh, not only is the Justice Department looking into it, I understand now that uh, the governor of the state of Florida has formed a task force to investigate what's taking place. Uh, I think all of us have to do some soul searching to figure out how does something like this happen. And that means that we examine uh, the laws and the context for what happened. Uh, as well as the sp uh, specifics of the incident. Uh, but my main message is, is uh, to the parents of uh, Trayvon Martin. Um, you know, if I had a son, he'd look like Trayvon. And, um, you know, I think they are right to expect that all of us as Americans uh, are going to take this with the seriousness it deserves and that we're going to get to the bottom of exactly what happened.